guys, you're welcome. Thanks for clicking. So this Jewish rabbi claims that the Messiah is coming this year. And this is what he saw. Why the Messiah is coming very soon. Let's check it out. This man claims that Messiah will be coming this year. Who is this Messiah? How is this man claiming that he will be coming this year? How are the Jews preparing themselves for the coming of the Messiah? Keep watching the video to find out. But before that, check this out. Times are tough and everyone is shifting their assets in more protected currencies such as Bitcoin. Islam teaches us to find new ways of survival. But there is no guarantee that they are halal. Islamic coin is the perfect crypto investment option for Muslims looking to adhere to their religious principles during challenging times. Islamic coin is led by a Sharia board that includes UAE royals. 10% of each issuance of Islamic coin is automatically dedicated for philanthropic purposes. Use the link in the description below to follow Islamic coin on social media and stay tuned for further updates as the world's first Sharia compliant crypto prepares for launch. We see Jewish Rabbi constantly telling their people that the time of Gulak, that is the appearance of their Messiah, is happening soon. This Messiah, according to their scriptures, will save them, lead them back to their homeland and build the third temple for the third temple. And this will mark the success and glory of the Jews. Brothers and sisters, all religious books have explained the appearance of Dajjal as the biggest fitna towards the end of times. For Christians and Muslims, Dajjal will be the fitna, the evil, and they will fight him. But for Jews, Dajjal is their savior. Jews will be the ones to support Dajjal in his fitna. And this man has predicted the coming of the Messiah. On what basis this man is saying this? Has he seen some signs? Brothers and sisters, according to Jews, a lot of signs have been completed. The first sign is the appearance of the red heifer. Just recently they uploaded a video of a young cow which got viral among the Jews and the Christians. What was so special about this heifer? This red heifer with a clear skin without any marks has been born after 2000 years. The book of Numbers, the fourth Bible clearly states that the Lord said to Moses and Aaron, this is a requirement of the law that the Lord has commanded. Tell the Israelites to bring you a red heifer without defect or blemish and that has never been under a yoke. This will be a lasting ordinance both for the Israelites and for the aliens living among them. The Christian priests and the Jewish rabbis strongly believe that if a red heifer takes birth again and they sacrifice it in the name of God, this will mark the success of their motives. Now that it has happened, they are sure that they will soon get the control of the Masjid al-Aqsa and the Hekel of Soleimani will be rebuilt soon. Another sign is the coming of snakes in the western part of their Great Wall of West. As the Jews were praying in front of their Great Wall of West, a snake came out from in between the stones of the wall. As it was coming out, coincidentally a pigeon was right in front of it. The pigeon turned around and flew away. This implies that hard times are coming for the Jews, which are signified by the snake. The pigeon signifies that the Jews will have to bear hardships and then the Messiah will come to save them from their hard times. Some pictures went viral in, in August 2019. They were shared by a Jewish rabbi in which some foxes could be seen roaming around the western well. A famous rabbi while sharing the photos of the foxes said, that one cannot refrain from crying at the sight of the fulfillment of the prophecy of foxes will walk on it. This is because according to an old prophecy, the western wall of the Jews will be inhabited by the foxes one day. This day will be marked as a sign that the Hekel of Soleimani will soon be built for the third time. The Jews will find the Tabut of Sakina and then the Jal will appear. Strong news sources suggest that the maps and plans for the construction of the third temple have been completed. And now the Israelis are only gathering strength and support from around the world to finally execute the plan. Israel has been making several connections with the rich Arab countries as well. They want support and backup for their evil plans. 
The government of Israel has made several attempts at demolishing the Masjid Aqsa and building back the third temple. Who is this Messiah? Brothers and sisters, according to the Jewish belief, the Messiah who is going to bring peace and end war in the world is actually the Dajjal. The Dajjal has successfully fooled these people into believing that the Dajjal will be their savior. But according to Islam, the real savior of the world who will bring peace and end restlessness in this world will be Hazrat Isa alayhi salam. A large war will be fought by the army led by Hazrat Imam Mahdi and Isa alayhi salam and will restore peace and Islam in the world. Jews and Israelis can make all the efforts in the world, join hands with all forces in the world, but the name and plan of Allah is the most superior. This nation has always been the most ungrateful and disobedient and for that they have always learned their lesson. And this time again, their efforts are only going to bring them to face the ground. Times are tough and everyone is shifting their assets in more protected currencies such as Bitcoin. Islam teaches us to find new ways of survival, but there is no guarantee that they are halal. Islamic coin is the perfect crypto investment option for Muslims looking to adhere to their religious principles during challenging times. Islamic coin is led by a Sharia board that includes UAE royals. 10% of each issuance of Islamic coin is automatically dedicated for philanthropic purposes. Use the link in the description below to follow Islamic coin on social media and stay tuned for further updates as the world's first Sharia compliant crypto prepares for launch. We see Jewish Rabbi constantly telling their people that the time of Gulak, that is the appearance of their Messiah, is happening soon. This Messiah, according to their scriptures, will save them, lead them back to their homeland and build the third temple for the third temple. And this will mark the success and glory of the Jews. Brothers and sisters, all religious books have explained the appearance of Dajjal as the biggest fitna towards the end of times. For Christians and Muslims, Dajjal will be the fitna, the evil, and they will fight him. But for Jews, Dajjal is their savior. Jews will be the ones to support the Jal in his fitna. And this man has predicted the coming of the Messiah. On what basis this man is saying this? Has he seen some signs? Brothers and sisters, according to Jews, a lot of signs have been completed. The first sign is the appearance of the red heifer. Just recently they uploaded a video of a young cow which got viral among the Jews and the Christians. What was so special about this heifer? This red heifer with a clear skin, without any marks, has been born after 2000 years. The book of Numbers, the fourth Bible clearly states that the Lord said to Moses and Aaron. Wow, so this is for the Jewish people. This Messiah they spoke about will come, will save them, will lead them back to heaven. And from there they will see the success and the glory of the Jews. There will be success, there will be glory and they will all be happy in heaven. And one of the, the signs he saw was the fox, that the fox is a proof that the Messiah will soon come because foxes are rare to see on the road. So for the foxes to be seen on the road, that is a great sign for them. So he's just talking about the Jewish people that their Messiah is coming very soon. And this was a beautiful one to watch. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next one.